How's it going everyone? I am back from fishing in Mammoth, California and having fun at Lake Powell. And so today's my first day back. I was in the office working. My wife says, hey, I got an order at Sprouts. Can you go pick it up? Okay, sure. I got a break in my schedule. Flip on my Walmart app, $28 shop. It's uh, 10 items, all candy and a case of water. Basically everything but the water was all in the same aisle. The shop took me six minutes Walmart is across the street um, from the Sprouts. Ran in there, took me six minutes to shop it, maybe another minute to, to bag a couple things. Threw it in the car. Now I'm sitting at Sprouts waiting for my wife's order. The delivery is a couple miles back towards my house. So 28 bucks, just going to get my wife's Sprouts, grabbing some Walmart, dropping it off on the way back home. You know, I don't have time to work these apps the way most people work these apps, which is like a main source of income. That's not what I do this for. I do this for content for the channel, but it really highlights how people that need maximum flexibility can use these apps. Just incorporate them into your daily life. You got some extra time, you wanna go out for a few hours, you can do that. But if you just cherry pick and you're out running errands, I've done a couple other videos on this, right? You don't have to try to make these things, you know, 40 hour work week, W2 type jobs like a lot of these drivers are trying to do and they're complaining that they can't earn a living wage or anything like that. I make over 40 bucks an hour, but I cherry pick and I'm very selective and I have a strategy and I try to incorporate that into my life. Speaking of which, my uh, Sprouts order is here. I gotta go get it loaded up, go drop off these Walmart groceries, go back to the office for my day job. 